Hello my dear friends, welcome to my channel. Now we have a very interesting question and most asked question from biology is why DNA is twisted? Yes, so the DNA is twisted in a form of staircase and we also be noted that it is a double helical structure and why the twisting is necessary for DNA? Why not it is a vertical staircase or why not it is not a staircase? Okay, let's reveal why the DNA is in staircase. Okay, so first we have to know where the DNA is located. The DNA is located inside the cell. Yeah, it is very easy. The DNA is present inside the cell. Either it is prokaryotic or eukaryotic. The DNA will be always in, be present inside the cell because the DNA is the genetic material. Here, a very interesting answer is before the DNA, RNA is the genetic material. Yes, RNA is the genetic material before the DNA. Through evolution, the DNA has evolved as a genetic material because the RNA is structurally unstable. It couldn't maintain the structure. But when it comes to DNA, DNA is stable in its structure. Yes, we already remind the word survival for the fittest. So the DNA is survival and it is the fittest one. So in an evolutionary period, the DNA is developed from RNA. But DNA is continued as a permanent genetic material both in prokaryotes as well as in eukaryotes. So the similarity between bacteria and a human, so a human and a monkey or human and a birds is nothing but the DNA. We all will have the DNA as the genetic material. Okay, so and the DNA is also called as the blueprint of our body. How the body has to be there, where the uh, protein, how much of the protein has to be needed and what type of the protein has to be produced in our body. Everything is being coded in a form of sequence, the DNA. Okay, so for example, you are taking an egg and you are breaking the egg. So in order to get the omelette, we have to break the egg. So I am telling it in a funny way. So whenever you are breaking the egg, egg, you will see the white part and yellow part. Yellow we call it as yolk and white is the albumin, nothing but the cytoplasm. Inside, you leave the white part. You Now you are taking the yellow part. Inside that yellow part, you will have the chromatin material. Inside the chromatin material, we have the DNA. Okay. So likewise, the DNA is present inside the cell, that too inside the nucleus, that too inside the chromatin material. Okay, now the DNA is very clear. So this is the picture is going to tell us cell. Inside, inside the cell, we have the nucleus. Inside the nucleus, we have the chromatin material. Inside the chromatin material, we have the DNA. Okay, so this is about the DNA and the DNA is the double print. So blueprint of our body. Let's see why the DNA is twisted. The very beginning we have started with a question. Why the DNA was twisted? Why the DNA was twisted means anywhere if the content is twisted, it has to be accommodated in a small area. Very huge amount of the DNA. If you unwind a thread, for example, you are taking a thread. Why you are rolling into a small bounce or in a form of small ball? The whole thread because it will accommodate in a small space. Yes or no? If you open the thread, it will be all over. It will occupy a huge area. In order to avoid the occupancy of the huge area, we are winding the DNA in a form of thread and that too in a form of helical staircase. In that case, in order to occupy a less amount of space, the DNA was being held in a form of twisted and double helical shape. Okay, DNA is known for its familiar twisted shape. The shape is often described as spiral staircase or twisted ladder. DNA is a nucleic acid. So the DNA is acidic with three main components. The DNA will have the majorly three main components, nitrogenous base, deoxyribose sugar and phosphate molecule okay these we will discuss in very descriptive way in the other videos now i am making it very simple interactions between the water and the molecules that composes the dna cause this nucleic acid 
to take a twisted shape okay one more time i am repeating the point interactions between the water and the molecules that compose the dna cause this nucleic acid to take a twisted shape so the shape aids means because of this shape only the packing of dna into chromatin material which condenses to form chromosomes the helical shape of dna is also makes dna replication and protein synthesis possible when necessary the double helix will unwinds unwinds means it will open the staircase and opens to allow the dna to be copied in replication as well as transcription okay because of this only the dna is twisted in shape this is the very very important point now we came to know the reasoning why the dna is twisted in a form of helical means because of the bonding between the water and the compounds which is the dna is made up of because of that thing only it is double helical in nature as well as in order to allow the transcription and replication also the dna is double helically staircase in nature okay my dear friends thank you very much for watching this if you have any doubts related to the topic of the dna please put it in the comment box if you like my video like it share to your friends because sharing the knowledge is very important and please to subscribe to my channel for more interesting updates thank you very much